All right, welcome back to The Walking Dead season three, episode three, where we found someone called Jesus and he hasn't done any miracles yet. We pleaded with them to let us in and apparently our big brother is the leader, which is very concerning. I checked the website, how long to beat to see if that ep that last episode was about an hour long and apparently it is about an hour long so I don't think I missed anything but when I'm done recording this game or when I'm doing post editing to quickly dish out some episodes I will be checking other people's playthroughs just to make sure it looks the same and if it doesn't and I missed something I'll go get that content I'll go grab something I'll do another playthrough just to grab that little segment that I missed, if there is something I missed. But the how how long to beat website says an hour, fifty seven minutes, so Okay. Can't really complain there, can I? Anyway, episode three Above the Law. Episode 5 looks very interesting. Episode 4 looks very action packed. And I shot Conrad! He put a gun to the little boy's head, and therefore he signed his death warrant. That was my reasoning, anyway. Also, I wasn't gonna stab Clementine in the back again. Let's go! Recording, recording, and recording. Good. All three. Previously on The Walking Dead. You don't have to fill his cup up anymore, baby. Grandpa is sleeping. No, Yaya. Pipo's awake. <gasps> Solamente está confundido. Mama. Oh my god. Oh my god. Hey! Put your hands up and close your eyes. Thanks. Mari! Oh. Shit! Kate! Javi, don't! Hey, what do we call you? Sorry, forgot to introduce myself. It's Paul, but my friends call me Jesus. I fucking knew it. You're one of them? You're goddamn right she is. If you want to shoot me, shoot me. How about I shoot your little boyfriend here instead? Holy shit! What the hell's going on out here? Oh my god. Hey, what's up? I guess we're getting that medical attention. But we ain't joining this group. Too many bad vibes. And go fuck yourself. I hate being out so close to dark. It's harder to see them coming. We're just gonna get that propane and then come right back. I, I saw it in that pickup truck parked down the road a little. In front of the Wallace's house. I just wish there was an easier way to get it. And that we didn't have to risk life and limb. Every damn day, for food and water, and gas for the stove. Maybe we can do without it. I mean, we're gonna have to eventually. It's a hell of a lot more than what we have right now. We need a working stove, which means we need more propane. Okay, if we're lucky, we won't see a single one of those things. <sighs> Fingers crossed. I mean, as long as you're careful, which there nobody is. is in this game, Games, uh, <coughs> plural. It should be easy to easy to go. 
Let's take it and go. Okay, then take it. Hopefully, it's not empty. <clears throat> empty. Ah, uh, it's empty. Of course, it is. <clears throat> You've got to be fucking kidding me! God damn it! <clears throat> of course, it's empty. Why would we get that lucky? Hey, keep it down. I know it sucks, Kate, but you gotta watch out. I'm sorry. I'm just sick of this shit. I just thought this one time we deserve to catch a fucking break. Oh, boy. You know, shit, get off. Yeah, stay. Bashy, bashy, bashy. I'm sorry. I was just so fucking scared. You froze. It's okay. I wanted to kill it. I really did. But Time to grow up. I know him. Not anymore, that was you don't. One of Cape's friends. True. He was so sweet. He always had a smile on his face. Okay. So you recognized him. That's no reason to let it kill you. And it was going to kill you. I know. I know you're right. I don't even know what to call them. Zombies. If they're not people. Daywalkers. If they're just the dead. <sighs> Muertos. That's what we'll call them. I thought we were gonna die. I thought Gabe and Mariana were just gonna wake up and we would just be gone. I'm right here, okay? I'm here. You're here. We're still alive. That's what matters. Can we go back now? If you want, let's go. Guy, so small. So small. I know we all wanted to stay here in the house and wait for David to come back, but it's been three months since he drove away with your mom. What are you saying? Oh, We're not that's safe here. what happened. Not anymore. You and I could have been killed out there for an empty can. There's got to be a safer place out there. What makes you think it's going to be better anywhere else? Everything and everyone outside this door is dead. Exactly. How long until one of those things gets in? We stay. Somebody's going to get hurt. Or worse. Relax. You really think the kids are going to be happy with this plan? The kids will understand. And if they don't, we'll just make them see it our way. We have to go. It's not How that come? easy. What if I don't want to leave? Cave. We're safe inside the house. And I bet we can find more food in the neighborhood if we just look harder. We're tired of being afraid. Every time we leave you guys alone. And it's just getting worse out there. Better to leave now. While we still can. But what about Dad? What's he gonna think if he shows up and we, we just ditched him? We might never find him again. Your dad would want us to do this game. He'd want us to survive. We've been surviving. Here. At home. Barely. I'm sorry, Gabe. But... Javi's right. Uh, how about you guys go and I stay here? You're a kid. That's not how it works. I can take care of myself. If I need any help, I'll just ask my friends. Gabe? They're all dead. Honey? What? What's, what's wrong with her? Why is she acting so weird? She's sad. 
because when we were out, we saw your friend, Drew, but it wasn't exactly him anymore. You mean, he, he was one of them? We're so sorry, Gabe. So you understand why, don't you? Why we have to leave? If that happened to you, I couldn't bear it. When do we have to go? Like, now? Tomorrow. As soon as it's daylight. I want to leave him a note. I'll help you get started. Okay? What are we gonna tell him? I want to say something good. Something that won't make him sad. Tell him we'll find him. Somehow. We're all gonna see each other again. I like that. I'm Good. gonna write it right now, so we don't forget. Of course. I'll You've all him. night. Thank you. Really. Now we go to future tense. After she blows out the candle, right? Yes. Oh, things are gonna get spicy. Shame the little girl had to die. You're just leaving it back there. It's a useful weapon. If only you guys knew what was ahead of you, you probably would have stayed in the house and died as a result. Or maybe you all will have survived, who knows? That's a whole different reality. Above the Law, Episode 3. Let's go. Dad? Javi? Is that really you? <laughs> I always hoped I'd find you. I... I thought you were dead, man. I, I thought you'd been dead for, for a long time. No such luck. I knew you were still alive. I knew it! Hey, weapons down! This is my family! You gotta let us in. Kate doesn't have much longer. Jesus. Kate! David? I'm here, honey. I'm right here. What the hell happened? She's been shot. And we got the bullet out, but she's still bleeding. We need your doctor. Now, David. Thanks, Javi. For getting her here. She's coming inside! But she hasn't been checked. This is my wife, Max. You want her to die? No, nope. I didn't say that. Our doctor's gonna help you, honey. I'm gonna make sure of it. Wait, I'm going everybody with you. Everybody else, we're all getting checked. Sorry, but the rest of you have to go straight to quarantine. What for? All newcomers get checked for bites, and they all have to answer a couple of questions. Our doctor will clear the two of them, but the rest of you have to come with me to the quarantine holding area. Fine. Let's just get this over with. Hobby. Make my job easy, would you? Listen to your friend. <sighs> Whatever you say. Well, let me guess, you're gonna take our guns off us too. Let's go!
Should be fine, right? Just gonna kick the bucket just yet. Trip. Oh God, Eleanor. Well, at least we know she's alive. When we found the car without you in it, I didn't know what to think. The engine up and died. I came here looking for help, and this happened. I've been so worried about Kate. I told them she needed a doctor. They promised me someone would look into it. They definitely didn't look for her, because she was still in the car. But that's crazy! I told them she was dying. And clearly it wasn't a priority. Well, at least those assholes realized she needed a hospital once they saw her. I'm sorry, Javi. Really, but Don't I worry didn't have about any reason it. not to believe them. What? The people here in Richmond, their new frontier. Oh my god. Oh, you ain't even heard the worst part yet. One of them's his brother. The leader is my brother. I didn't even know you had a brother, Javi. Hey, nobody's more surprised than me. I, I thought the guy was dead. We haven't seen David in years. It's just been me, Kate, and the kids this whole time. I don't even want to think about what the odds are, but he did seem pretty damn surprised to see you. Whoever this guy is, he can't be all bad, right? No, he's all bad. I mean, he helped Kate instead of hauling her down here. Of course he brought her inside. She's his damn wife. You're kidding. Kate is married to your brother? The only reason I know Kate is because she married David. I was the best man at their wedding. Wow. Okay. Family drama aside, hope you know I'm not about to make nice with New Frontier. Don't need to. I know you didn't have much stake in Prescott Hobby, but they burned that place to the ground for no fucking reason. After everything you folks told me, I'm guessing I'm not gonna find my people alive. Hell, Javi. They killed your niece! Shot Kate! For all we know, your brother could have been behind it. And even if it wasn't his idea in the first place, if he knew about it and didn't stop it... I hate to admit it, but there's a chance he gave the order. If he didn't know it was them, if he was just trying to get payback for what was stolen, it's possible. What was he like when you knew? You guys get along. He seemed happy enough to see you up there. If you want to hear me say he's an asshole, fine. He's the biggest asshole I know. Question is, is he a big enough asshole to go along with some of the shit they've done? If your brother knew anything about what happened in Prescott, he's got to answer for it. They all do. I owe that to Conrad. I'm not just going to let things slide. I've never really been an eye for eye kind of man. But people died. We need to even out the scales. We need to look like we're playing along with their rules. Go along with what they say. For now. Then, when the time is right, that's when we demand justice. Hey. Yo. Hey. I would have been here sooner, but I had to take care of... something. Come on already. Kate's asking for you. Maybe you think it's okay to keep a lady waiting. What about the rest of my friends? They're not invited. Hurry up now. Looks like the rules don't apply to everyone, huh? That's right. Some people get out of here early. Others stay a long fucking time. Trip, just drop it, okay? Smart cookie, this one. Javi. Just go. Do I get a choice? I'll put in a good word for you, okay? See if we can't hurry the process along a bit. Thanks. I'm just gonna leave that door open. Wide open. Is no one gonna close that door? Jesus Christ. But quarantine, you're not doing very good at quarantining. 
door wide open like. Go along with them for now? That doesn't sound good. We have oh, a process. Our own way of doing things. Your guys better not have a problem with that. Things don't go well for troublemakers here. I hope that's clear. I try to use quarantine to protect our people. It's nothing personal. I mean, all it takes is one murder in this place to have one person come and kill everybody. Where are we going? Kate asked for you. I thought you'd want to check on her. Listen, Javi, Gabe. He told me some pretty messed up things. Oh yeah, like what? Things I need your help wrapping my head around. He shouldn't have done that. I wanted to tell you myself. Bad news is bad news. Who cares who delivers it? He told me you lost Mariana. Just a few days ago. Oh. I'm sorry, David. She's... She's gone. Your people shot her. It's strange grieving for the same person twice. Like losing something you didn't know you had. What was she like, Javi? She was so little when we got separated. Who did my little girl become? We got along well. Her smile kept me going through a lot of rough times. That... must have been nice. How... How did she die? Tell me how it happened. Please, I need to know. She was just standing there, minding her own business. She just found her lost headphones in the dirt. She was smiling. And then someone put a bullet in her head. What kind of animal would just open fire on her like that? <laughs> An animal with your mark. My people aren't in the habit of killing little girls. David, I was there. They shot Kate too. Ask your buddy at the gate if you don't believe me. Max was a part of this? Fuck. I need details. What the hell went down out there? I need to know exactly what happened. Everything you remember. Bastards knocked me out and threw me in their truck. I got away near this town, Prescott. The same assholes attacked us there. Their leader flooded it with walkers and, and tear gas. Leader? A crazy bald guy with a beard. Badger. What the fuck have you done now? I'm gonna handle that stupid son of a bitch, okay? Do me a favor. Keep this to yourself. The politics here, they can get messy. I thought you were the boss. There's four of us that run, Richmond. You need to impress the other three. Or you'll be back on the road by morning. Honestly, being back on the road sounds like heaven. I don't think I want to be here. Try not to here. stir things up. You and your friends could have a very short stay. You wouldn't let that happen, would you? We only just got here. It's not just up to me. I run security here. But it's not like my word is law. This shit with Badger doesn't make things any easier. Where else that bald bitch? Who's the fresh meat? Ava is my brother, Javi. The baseball brother? <laughs> no shit. What are the chances of you turning up on the doorstep? It's a pleasure to meet you, Ava. Oh, is it now? <laughs> you didn't say he was a gentleman, David. That's because he's not. Ava's my right hand. If there's anyone you can trust in Richmond, it's her. Oh, yeah? Doesn't look very trustworthy. She's got that look. Just face looks That woman. They're all a wrong. fucking soldier. Maybe that's She was the like, first person I met up with after you and me got separated. Soldier. I never would have made it without her. Gabe said you went back to the house at the start. I'm sorry I never found you. Did you even try? Oh, 
Brilliant. We waited for you. For three months. Eventually the house was overrun and we had to move. Why didn't you come back? Mama and I got routed out of the city on the way to the hospital. It wasn't long before she... Poor Mama. I couldn't get back into Baltimore, so I hooked up with my old unit. We thought we could build a safe zone outside D.C. After what happened to Mama and everyone else, I thought you were all dead. But you were taking care of them, weren't you? Yes. Somehow you found a way. I'm not gonna lie. I never thought you had it in you. The day Dad died, I promised I'd stick around. Be there for the family. Well, can't my word. Took the end of the world, but you finally grew up. Oh yeah, and where are you? In your cozy little campsite. This is where they're treating Kate. Don't get comfortable. We're not staying long. I don't want to stay here. If anything, I want to see this place burn. Sorry to all the innocent people here, but this place is burning whether you like it or not. And you're only hey. doing this because hey, we're related. Got everything you need? Uh, yeah. This place is like a resort. Check it out, Javi. Noodles in a cup. We need to get you some real food. Stat. Turn you into a soldier. <laughs> Javi, I'm glad you're okay. Of course we're okay. <laughs> Get off hey, me. Up. You know me. I'm always okay. Damn, it's good to have you back. Look at this family. Look at my wife. Isn't she the most beautiful woman alive? Come on. With the lights off, you could mistake me for a walker. You're a lucky man, David. We're all lucky. Uh, oh, what, you okay? Uh, my... oh, shit. I'll get the doc. I'm fine. I just needed to talk to you, alone. Why, what's wrong? I'm scared, Javi. More than I was the whole time on the road. Even when I thought I was going to die, everything inside me screams to get away from here. These people are killers. And David? Yeah, I know what you mean. This place gives me the creeps. <sighs> I'm glad to hear that. I was afraid you'd been won over by the security here. It's no. always been you and me on the road, Javi. That's how we've made it this far. Please, promise me we'll go back to that. The first chance we get. This place. It's a cage. We can't let ourselves get locked in. I'll find a way, Kate. You have my word. Rest up. You're gonna need your strength. Thanks. I feel better. Knowing we're in this together. But please hurry. I I don't want to be left alone here. Don't worry about it. Feeling better? How you doing, sweetheart? David reported some pain. It's less now. Strange how it just comes and goes. She was rambling a bit. Yeah, I think she's delirious. Well, she seems cogent now. But it's nothing to be alarmed about. Pain often comes in waves with abdominal wounds. <laughs> I'll give you something to take the edge off, in case it comes back. Truly superlative work. I thought I'd have to operate, but... All she needed was IV fluids and some antibiotics. How did you find someone with skills like these? A wound like this kills 9 out of 10. That would be Eleanor. One of my friends you threw in quarantine. Well, she's no use to anyone there. We should let her out. I'll vouch for her. Well, that's one. Agreed. I'll have Ava bring her here. I want to meet this Eleanor. I'm sure she'll be an asset to our community. You can't just cherry pick who you want. Why don't you let them all out? Can they all perform surgery on a dirt floor with a pair of pliers and no anesthetic? There's your answer. Javi and I have to go meet some people now. See if we can't prove he's worth a damn. We're gonna take real good care of you. Okay? Are you? Cause she's freaking Send out. Send my apologies, David. I won't be able to make it. Feeling okay? Fine. 
I just want to keep an eye on my patient. The others know my vote is with you. That's nice. Come on. That's two Remember versus two. Remember what I said. There's four of them, when right? Meet these guys. Two of them. Keep what happened to Mariana to yourself. Badger is one of my guys, and I will handle him. Depending on what gets said, I might be able to keep my mouth shut. You, pro you should probably keep me out of that room. 